Hello, it's someone with 8567, and this is Lamborghini Mary Challenge. This is Nashville. We got two up. We got one that looks like a rock star and one that looks like a grease greaser. Let's get cooking. It's Nashville, and we are going to start our bets. You guys liking the project so far? Doing good? Good. And we're at 800 on this round. He's going to raise us, of course. This guy loves to put money in, if I remember. So we should get a good pot out of this. If I remember correctly. See, 15 thou for me, and he's already at the 21, they're already trying to race each other. That's very good for me. I'm gonna put a little bit more money down. And let's see, these two. We got the Rocker Henry and the Greaser Brett, and they're gonna stand. It's gonna be a high pot. And we're hitting the road. It is a night course! Oh dear god, right? You can barely see the road. Well, this one's not as bad as others. I mean, if this is your first race, you could do this one. It's not impossible. And this one's very forgiving. There are ones later down the lot on the road on the line. You can barely make out the road. So if you don't have a certain upgrade from the store, which we'll get later, this is an upgrade to help you actually see at night. Then be able to help you more with that. Again, same rules apply. And you can actually still see them even without the lamps. But without the uh, items you're going to need, it's not a lamp. I'm going to tell you that right now. Why would you carry a lamp in your car? I wouldn't be too smart. But you can tell by the backlights where the cars are. Like in that example. So that makes it easier to avoid them in this situation. So if you can tell by the light where the cars are, you can easily get around them, making this not as bad as it could be. That's really the only tip I can give you for night driving. I mean, it works, and hopefully it'll help you. Hopefully I can stay on the road. We keep going, we're at 52% doing well. Haven't used the boost yet, which is good. We don't want to use our boost unless it's a big emergency. Oh no, it's big emergencies coming in Division 2 or Division 1. Because trust me, those are when the races start to get a little more fun. And we're still basically on easy street here. Just trying to get around these courses, trying to avoid all problems, trying to get through these races. So, the more there's not much we can do. Just zipping around these cars, getting to the finish. Automated process in, automated process out. And there we go, we're going to get around these two. You start to see some of the patterns that the game will take with the cars. It's not a true pattern, I mean there is some randomization, but... Some cars do have certain patterns, you'll notice. Even though that still won't help me too much. What can you do? As long as you finish races, come in, come in high, hopefully first. Especially if you have gambling on, because that's the only way you win the pot. Thank you very much. And you perform well, you should get your division challenges, and we will be finishing races like that. A smooth 20k, we are done with Nashville. So I got a little itch in my ear. And that's why I got itchy at the end of that race, but at least after the race, not during. Now what to do next? We got 70,000, I need 50, so I can probably buy an upgrade for 20,000. Let me see if there's any good ones. I'll probably just go for broke. Might just go for broke. Yeah, let's kick this thing in the fifth gear. Fi the fifth gear is now added onto our vehicle. It will actually raise our top speed as well, like every other upgrade. That's right. It actually helps. So we're racing Des Moines versus three people. We got our rock star Henry, we got Felicia, and we got. Oh, I don't remember his name. Uh, I'm trying to remember. There's two. It's either. I think it's Frankie. If I'm wrong, you've been seeing the names. They've, I put them in for you, so if I'm wrong, you'll see the right name. Don't worry too much. But yeah. I'm pretty sure that is Frankie. And he's already driven the pot to 2100. I know Felicia is not going to go for it. 
I think she's already out. So it's a three-way battle. The girls usually seem to go for the lower limit, and there's only two females racing, so... Oh, boy. A 9,600 pot, I have 5,000 money in case I bork this, but I won't, and we are now in ice conditions! That's right, we're sliding. <sighs> this is already not gonna be fun, cause turns get a lot harder on the ice, as anyone who's driven a car knows. Unfortunately, I haven't. I actually do not have my license. Oh, by the way, 242 miles per hour. No, 252. 253, yeah, 253. I'm trying to look at speed on or tell my speed. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that stinks. That picture up in the upper left hand corner. Remember, I said there's one more event I wanted to tell you about? I didn't want that to be on this course, but it's here. Blue and white cars? Yeah. We got Popo. Now, they don't try to pull you over in this game. They try to wreck you. They have a high speed they go at, and as you can see, I'm just getting wrecked on the ice. Get off me. This is not good. There. Okay, I'm out of here. I'm going to use my first boost. Wee! Whoa. If I'm going to be doing that every time I boost, I'm going to get lightheaded, but yeah. But you can see we had the offender tag above us, and we used our first boost by the way. You can see how they work. The offender tag tells you what car the police are currently going after. If you hit a police car, they will chase you. If they catch you speeding, no matter if there's someone else going faster, I've noticed they always targeted you, unless you're far enough ahead and they catch someone else, a closer target. But, yeah. They will try to destroy your car. And you do not want your car destroyed because that ends your race, that puts you out of commission, you lose your money, you gotta pay for your repairs, it just levels you in this game. So, I had to use my first boost. Nothing much I can do there, but I got the lead. And we're currently in a situation where I'm a little upset I had to use that early, but like I said, it's random crapshoot. The car, the police won't always appear on a course. You notice that it said probable, certain, and other things? Depending on if the car, if the police will show, will be when you see all this stuff. I think this was a possible race too, and they showed up. I just wish it was. This is the only course I wish I didn't get the cops on because they just wrecked the car, but we won. So we're done here. That was awful, but it's good. We're okay. We're still in first. We're still fine. We just have a lot of car damage. I'm just gonna... I think I'm just gonna go on to the next course, because there's no reason why we shouldn't hear. And we're going to Chicago. My girlfriend's home state, basically against Otomo. I'm not even gonna bother repairing the car because I know I don't have enough for an upgrade now. And now is where you gotta start thinking on keeping 50,000. Because like I said, if you run out of races and you don't have the money, you're done. So right now I'm only gonna upgrade when I have enough money past 50,000 to know that I'll be okay. And we're currently at 2,000 against Otomo. There's 23, and he stands at 22. We're going to hit the road. The pot's at 4,500, and it will now give you a chance to repair your car again. That's right. It'll give you, if, you do, if you do have car damage, it'll let you repair before the race, too. So don't feel like you missed repairing. That's it. You do get a second chance. And now we're in Chicago. I definitely don't think we're on LSD or the Dan Ryan. Because from what my girlfriend told me, this place gets busy with that. <sighs> I wonder if I'll be seeing the Blues Brothers or will be passing by Jewel anytime soon. They're just going around. And, oh, there's road cleaning on this course. Let's see if we can get some more monies. Because especially now, money's always good. Especially after that hefty repair bill we're going to be taking from getting bashed around by police. Yeah, very easy. Just gotta try to stay on the road and take out the cones. Oh, not again! 
two in a row! My luck is wonderful. They must have called in from out of state. Ay, 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 I gotta get out of here. The Midwest is not treating me well today. Boy, we're halfway done already with this race. You can tell that they're getting faster. Because I'm actually able to keep myself on the road and keeping a good high speed, they're having trouble keeping up with me, even though they are trying. When you see their na when, the when you see their photo in the grid, you can tell that they're close enough to you where they can do something like that. Man, you just say miss the cones and just run for it, but we might just go deep and run. This one's not going well. I wish I had someone I could just slam into them, so they chase the others instead, but. Unlucky for me, unlucky for this. It is not good, not good, not good, not good. Hey. Well, we're doing okay. I think we're getting away. I think we're not going to take as much of a hit as last time. They do have one other trick to get you to lose money, and I think it might actually happen during Division 3. I've had it happen in Division 3, I've had it not happen, and happen in Division 2, but we'll have to see what happens. 9, 100, and 100% done with this race, we're not dead, we are actually better than last race, so I'll take it. <sighs> and we didn't topple a whole massive pile of cars. Okay, race good, we're done, we're race good, we got... Actually, six more? Yeah, six. I'll do one more race for this one. Let's see. Which one? First of all, I got 56. Ugh. In play money, in hope money, I got 5,200 I can use to upgrade. Let's see what we can get now. Ooh, the sixth. Gears up. Nah, I'm not gonna buy. I could, but like I said, I'm gonna hold out because, like I should say, I should. We can now see we have the automatic six gear available. Next upgrade we're gonna get is gonna be the six gear manual. The automatic will always appear before the manual, so if you want the manual and you see the automatic, you know it's coming soon. Just one more upgrade. And yeah, this is where the start getting pricey with their upgrades. We're pretty well upgraded already, I'll be honest. I mean, we're, I want to say, halfway through the shop, I want to estimate. We'll have to keep going. Meanwhile, we're in Portland, Oregon versus Hagger the Horrible. Yes, I always call him that. We're just going to run him up, because I know he'll run up to about 30. I really need the money. Okay, 2,600. Yeah, I'll take it. Let's go do this. Another night course, and yeah, you can tell this one's a little darker. Still not impossible. It could be just me and the screen I'm looking at, because I know most of the courses I can barely see a thing, so it could have been on an older TV I was playing on, it was just too dark to see. But either way, now it's all serious business. We're, we got better locals, actually, if you noticed. And most of them have gone up a class. I can remember to write down the levels of difficulty that these racers get and actually tell you more about them in the next couple of episodes because that's something I did want to go over but right now I'm more concerned about winning this race and I gotta make sure I win and three in a row <laughs> three times the lucky winner of the cops they love me today don't they well, either way, we got him on our butt again. Let's... Oh, get away from... Oh, shoot. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Yeah, they'll never attack one of the green or yellow cars, but they hit a red car, they will trigger and get out of my way. They will try to sandwich you. And they can cause a lot of damage if they can get you in a sandwich. So, you need to stay away from them. Oh man, why do I keep getting these guys? I mean, this is like the third race in a row. Yeah, it is the third race. It's not like the third. It is the third. And we're gonna keep going. We're almost to the end. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. 83% still got them on our butts. We gotta keep going. 
It's not our lucky day. And this, damn it, this guy looks kind of nice right now. And you got the, what well, looks like the sun rising, you got the background. They did, that's one thing they had for this game, at least a little bit of gra beautiful graphics, but we're done. We are done. 40,000 in the pot. Well, in our hands, not in our part, in a pot. There's more money there. Poof. And it's only 15 minutes in. You know what? I think I'll go for one more, because if I do, I can do four this episode and four next episode, and we'll finish the division next episode. So I'm going one more. Let's do this. Let's party. Got enough money, I'm gonna buy these, I think. Should I? Yeah. I'm going for broke. We got enough. I mean, we'll be able to make it up in time. Hmm. There's no one there. No one there. No one there. There's amateur locals. There's good locals. Amateur is the lowest level. The good is a step up. There's even higher. But yeah, I'm gonna take... Let's see. I usually try to go for the lowest course left when it gets to this situation. Of course, sometimes I'll take the highest if I know I need it. I see good in certain night course amateur. And I'll take this one. Let's go Minnesota. Only my luck, I'll get four cops in a row. That or this will be the last one that has cops for a while. Now, certain does not mean definite. It means that there's a very, very good chance of it happening. And we got a mosh pit. So I remember saying about not being able to get careful driver easily with some of these setups. It's things like that that really you just can't win. Yeah, this game is not fair when it comes to that. But what can you do? An icy cover road in the middle of Minnesota and we're going to keep racing because all we got is locals and we're only in 7th. I don't want to use my second boost this early in the game. If I do, I know I'm going to be in deep trouble. Wait, I hope you don't get annoyed that there's only two main soundtracks in the game for races. But there is one more race theme that we haven't heard yet, but we'll go over that later. And ow, nice little sandwich. I actually have my finger ready to trigger on the boost. But now I can take it off because I don't need to worry. Because we're in first and I think we can hold it now. Nice wide road, there's not really much in danger of us, so no need to worry, and I don't think there's going to be police on this course. I don't know when they usually appear, but if they usually don't appear by the 50% marker, they don't appear at all. I said usually there have been exceptions on me, and I don't remember any of them offhand. I've had the rare time where they have shown up past 50%, but we're good. We are good, we're gonna make it through, and we're not gonna have an all-police episode. That'd be, that'd be fun, having an all-police episode. That'll probably be our late, later episodes in this, but either way, we're almost done, we're gonna make it. So next time, we're gonna finish the net last three races, after, as soon as we take this one, of course. And after we take those next three, we're going on to the division fine championships and winning this division. And that, if you heard that, that's my tablet telling me I got something. That's all for this one. Hope you had fun and see you on the next one.